Hello. Um, for tonight's video, I'm going to be reading another poem by Edgar Allan Poe. And this one is going to be Lenore. Now, what I have in mind is that nightly I'm going to update my channel with a new poem by Edgar Allan Poe. However, once I'm done with the poems by Edgar Allan Poe, I'm not sure whether I should read Edgar Allan Poe's short stories, which are actually a little lengthy for a video, or if I should just move on to another poet. However, I have been getting a couple of suggestions for poets to read um, on the Edgar Allan Poe video, the last one that I posted. And so what I'm thinking is that I just might move on to another poet to read. So that's the plan for right now. But for right now, as well, I'm going to be reading the poem Lenore. So, to start, it goes as thus. Ah, broken is the golden bowl, the spirit flown forever, that the bell toll a saintly soul floats on the Stygian river, and guide thee there, hast thou no tear? Weep now or nevermore. See on yon drear and rigid bier, low lies thy love, Lenore. Come, Lenore. let the burial rite be read, let the funeral song be sung, an anthem for the queenliest dead that ever died so young, a dirge for her, the doubly dead, in that she died so young, Lenore. Wretches, he loved her for her wealth and hated her for her pride. And when she fell in feeble health, he blessed her that she died. How shall the ritual then be read? The requiem how be sung? By you, by yours, the evil eye, by yours, the slanderous tongue, that did to death the innocence that died and died so young? Pecavimus, but rave not thus, and let a Sabbath song go up to God, so solemnly the dead may feel no wrong. The sweet Lenore hath gone before, with hope that flew beside, leaving thee wild for the dear child that should have been thy bride. For her, the fair and debonair, that now so lowly lies, the life upon her yellow hair, but not within her eyes. The life still there, upon her hair, the death upon her eyes. Avant, tonight my heart is light, no dirge will I appraise, but walk the angel on her flight with the pain of old days. Let no bell toll, lest her sweet soul, amid its hollow mirth, should catch the note as it doth float up from the damned earth. To friends above, from fiends below, the indignant ghost is riven. From hell unto a high estate, far up within the heaven. From grief and groan to a golden throne, beside the kingdom of heaven. 